hello dear students so welcome back to another pyq which is very confusing for some students to figure out where they should mark confounding factors where they should mark effect modifier so look at the question okay a study is done to establish relationship between smoking and lung cancer found that the association was more in people who exercised less and less in people who exercised more so what is exercise now whenever you get a question like this where you're going to have three variables the first thing you need to figure out what is the exposure and what is the outcome okay so here i am trying to study smoking and lung cancer right it's clearly written and there is a third variable which we are talking about here is exercise now is it a confounder or an effect modifier now suppose we were studying smoking and cvd the third factor was let's say alcohol now is it a confounder effect modifier please remember for any variable to be a confounder okay for any variable to be a confounder it has to fulfill two criteria what are those okay it has to fulfill two criteria guys what are those two criteria number one if if those are not fulfilled it's not a confounder okay whenever you talk about the exposure um, whenever you talk about the confounder it has to be associated with exposure okay it has to be associated with exposure and the second thing is that that third variable should be an independent risk factor for the outcome okay it has to be associated with exposure and it should also be an independent risk factor for outcome okay for outcome so if you look over here alcohol those who smoke do they drink research has shown yes so the third variable is also associated with exposure and can alcohol independently lead to cvd yes alcohol also has an independent relationship with cvd it can independently also lead to cvd therefore this variable is a confounder it should be associated both with exposure and outcome and it should also be an independent risk factor for the outcome but if i look at this third variable exercise is it like those who smoke do they exercise nowhere research has shown that or is it like exercise is protective for lung cancer if you exercise you will not go on to develop lung cancer no then what is this so it does not fulfill the criteria of confounders what is this this is an effect modifier that means effect modifier is a variable under whose effect it can either aggravate okay it either aggravates that means increases or decreases the effect of an exposure on outcome okay it's either going to increase the effect of exposure on outcome or decrease so people who smoke have a risk of lung cancer if the people who are smoking are exercising the exercise will decrease the effect of smoke on lung cancer okay that is why it is an effect modifier okay because it was not fulfilling the criteria of confounders you just have to see is the third variable common to exposure and outcome both or not if not then is it increasing the effect of the exposure and outcome or is it decreasing in both the cases it will become an effect modifier selection bias is altogether a different thing right uh, it is seen in case control like i know that a drug works at 102 degree fahrenheit so i select all those cases who suffer from fever have fever more than 102 or 102 all right that is what is selection bias thank you so much